is your full name and family background? My name is Matthew Curtis Simon Fong. My mom is born here. Grandparents are from southern China. My grandma on my dad's side is from southern China. And my grandpa, my, dad, my dad's father, is from Malaysia. So I'm like 1.5 generation Canadian. What? Yeah. So you can speak more than one language, right? I can <clears throat> kind of speak Cantonese and Mandarin, but fluently, it would be English. Yeah. So if you were to describe yourself in three words, what would you use? Um, I like to think of myself as someone who is loyal. Um, let's say, I want to say that I'm also very... I'm humorous. I think I'm funny. Yeah, Matthew's funny. But you know, let's also say maybe not to be too full of myself. I can be cynical. That's one cynical that's movie. Funny. Okay, so what advice would you give to a new SFU student? I would highly encourage them to attend events such as orientation, even frosh. You know, like for me, I went to both of them. And I made tons of friends from there. Mm -hmm. And I think that it's a really good opportunity to even meet the people you're with. Because in first year, you're, with, you're in all these classes with them. And it's good to just know them beforehand. So once you go to class, you have people that are there like, oh, hey, I met you there before. Let's hang out. Let's sit together. Yeah. Yeah. What is the worst class you've ever taken at SFU? What motivates you to work hard? Being able to know that I can watch anime at the end of the day and not be stressed. <laughs> so, what is something that people don't really know about you? Something that people don't really know about me is probably that I'm really gassy right now. So, like, I'm trying not to, you know. But yeah. TMI, I don't really care. Okay. What do you like to do in your free time? My free time, honestly, I'm a really boring person. I don't really have any hobbies as much. I kind of like to. I guess some of the things I really do enjoy is probably just watching Netflix and anime. Yeah, computers and stuff. Yeah. So what is your spirit animal? I want to say Caitlyn Jenner because I know when I'm older, I'm a look hotter than my ex-wife. What's your favorite color, or which color do you feel describes you best? I have two favorite colors, red and green. Um, the main reason why, though, is actually because I'm obsessed with like cherry-flavored stuff, like lollipops, oh, and I also like lime. So red and green, that's, that's how I derived my favorite colors. That's really cute. Yeah. That's a good story. Okay, so what's your favorite TV show, cartoon, or anime of all time? I really like Modern Family. I'll go with that. Okay. Really funny. I can watch any episode anytime. I'll still laugh at it. Right? Previous ones from like How I Met Your Mother. Mm -hmm. Although I'm not, I, I will admit, if I watch an episode, there's a guarantee I'm going to laugh at it. But it was a good go through. Yep. In terms of anime, I would say number one is Card Chapter Sakura. I'll admit that. Yeah, my favorite. List two pet peeves. Oh. It's going to list 200. <laughs> <laughs> Let's see, if I focus on two, I really want to say ingenuity. Mm. Is that right? it right? You know, I don't like fakeness. I think it's kind of like a big flaw in people. And I just, I like to know people, you know? Just need to know them and know how they actually are and how they actually interact with people. I think that's really good. It's a good characteristic to have, to be genuine. Mm -hmm. Another pet peeve that would probably be 